What is good everybody? Welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Today we are showcasing everything that was in my office that is actually packed up now, man. Look at this absolute insanity. Also, I apologize for the echoing. It's very echoey in here. Plan on adjusting some of that stuff. Gonna put like some padding up and things like that, of course. But uh, this is the result, man. Look at all of these boxes of figures different drawers full and stuff like that man when i tell you i had to take all of these boxes and carry them one by one up the stairs i had to do that i did i had to take every single one of these boxes lift them up and take them up the stairs and it was absolute insanity but all of these boxes are full of random things and different superstars and all that stuff so i want to showcase a little bit of what we got going on here so it looks like in this box over here we do have like the jeff hardy collection and stuff like that some of these again i did put in bags and stuff some of these i did not put in bags though you guys can see this is that custom jeff hardy that we did on surgery there's that like galaxy face paint jeff hardy that we got from bw that we had made but some of these are in here we got willow in here we have the punisher jeff hardy in here another skull face jeff hardy and a lot of this, this is packed up like last minute, which is why I actually ran out of time packing all this stuff up. So some of them I did not put in bags, but here's the Jeff Hardys, also the Hulk Hogan's and stuff like that. I think this is actually the last box. I think in our last video, I showcased this box that was not quite packed up yet. Well, now we finally have it all packed up and things like that. We also have my drawers full. If you guys were wondering how I store my accessories, how I store my cloth goods, my weapons, things like that, that is where this stuff goes. So this is full of weapons and all that different jazz right here. Maybe one day we could do like a detailed video of this stuff. I plan on reorganizing it because I'll have much more space now. Used to, these used to be in the closet and I actually do have a closet attached to this office that's over there. So that is good because I'm gonna freaking need it because there's no way all this stuff is going on the wall. If you guys can see here, it's definitely much bigger than the last one was but the ceiling's not as tall so i think i prefer rather having like a little bit more walking room and stuff like that rather than having taller ceilings over here we do have uh my box full of look fin battlers we have some customs in there as well again didn't put everything i don't even know where the cut okay there it is this is the custom box so we like lean over right here and open that up you guys can see there's all like my customs i put those in little Ziploc bags so that they wouldn't get damaged or what have you, but a bunch of old Seth Rollins fix up. Got some Richards in here. There's that Kenny Omega we talked about last time. We have, what in the hell is this? Okay, I think this one is a little bit lighter of a box. Brother Love in here, missing his glad. Jesus Christ, man. I don't think I packed this box up. It looks like we have some CM Punks in here. You got the Elite 16 CM Punk. Got some Austins, got the Ultimate Edition Muhammad Ali. So there is that box. The good thing though is that they are just like sitting on top of one another. So I don't have to worry about them shifting and things like that. But a lot of these boxes are also full of men on card figures. So here we have some men on card figures. Got some of my retro card Spider-Man stuff. I think this was the current roster shelf over here. You got Cody, Ultimate Cody, Seth, Logan Paul, those figures. And then right here we do have like the Romans, the Shawn Michaels, we have like some Kurt Angles in there. So this is like that one section, that one right side wall or whatever. So what's nutty is we have all these loose figures in these boxes and then we have the drawers full of figures and then we have the accessories and men on card figures. And right at this moment, I have no idea where the hell I'm going to be putting everything. I think I'm going to be putting my desk right here. So there's the door. Thought about painting my door as well, like the outside of it, like doing like a mural style. Putting like a mural on the door. I don't know exactly what I'll put on there. I feel like it needs to have something to do with the channel though, you know, like probably some zebra print MDT logos and stuff. But I meant like maybe John Cena in one and then another and kind of stuff like that, like maybe like painted. And then this was actually a gift for my brother, my last birthday, not this past birthday, but the birthday before that. And it's a pretty damn big, like this is pretty big. You guys can see my hand right here. Really big MDT sign. I thought this won't fit on the door because it's too big, but I think I'm going to pick like an empty wall or something like that, stick that on there. And then I thought about doing an accent wall where it would be this like uh, light pink and darker pink zebra print up and down the walls or whatever, but I don't know what if I'll do that. I, I don't know, man. A lot of things up in the air, but definitely got to get some of this situated. And ever since we started moving, I have been working on this and moving the office and getting all those different things squared away. So it has been a ton of of different work and loading and stuff like that. I'm so damn sick of loading boxes, man. I mean, look at all these boxes. Think about loading those in the back of a truck and then loading those over and going up the stair, up and down the stairs like 40 times. Not a fun time, but it'll be worth it. We'll get it squared away, we'll get it worth it. Look at how dark this one looks. This box just looks dark when you look at it, but it's all the damn shield pants and stuff from Roman Reigns. So there's some Roman Reigns figures. I think this is actually the current roster shelf, so I don't know what the hell I was talking about over here. This looks to be like the rock shelf for the rock shelves, but I did throw in like the ultimate Logan Paul and stuff like that on top of it. But 
I did neatly place these. I wasn't just slamming them into a box. They have shifted just slightly, but I did sit them in there like one by one, right? And I like tried my best to keep them squared away and everything like that so we wouldn't get like any looseness or anything. But as far as the rest of the room is concerned, I think I'm gonna put like my desk and stuff here. I have a really badass like blue eyes white dragon rug I'm gonna put down. And then as far as like the arena, I don't know if I wanna put the arena on this wall, the arena on this wall, or do I want it right behind the door? I don't know, I'm still playing around with that stuff. But I definitely, I'll go, I'll go in here and show you guys the closet. So there's a bathroom connected and then when you go all the way through, you do have the closet here, which is a lot bigger of a closet than in the closet in the old house. So a pretty decent amount of space in here, man. It's way bigger. It's probably three or four times the size of the last closet. And we do have this nice, this is pretty much the exact same shelf that was in the last closet, but this one was already here. So it's not like I took that shelf and put it here. This was already here. So I do have this shelf space. You, you guys know that I have that like house place set I could put in here to put stuff on, which is what I did in the old office. So I don't know, definitely plenty of space here. Got some nice facility lighting in here. Got a crawl space in there for monsters to come get me. And then if we walk on, back through just chaos pure chaos so this is definitely something i'll be chipping away at over the next few days and i'll get you know the the everything set up there so we can continue getting the videos out but i do plan on getting the the backstage set up and all those different things the review station everything like that set up but i want to change it up a little bit man i don't want to keep it the exact same ultimate editions in here man like you wouldn't believe there's so many freaking things men on card in here and they take up so much room i think this is the roster shelves what was before but i don't think i don't think i'm doing what i said man i don't think i'm taking the singular wooden shelves and going up and down the walls i think I think if I were to do the old shelving method that I used last time, I feel like it would fill up the walls really, really fast. And I don't want to do that. I want to use the space as much as possible. I want to maximize the space that I have. However, we will see about all those things, man. But I did want to give you guys a quick little update here and just showcase all these different boxes full of WWE figures that we have here. And if you guys don't see something in here specifically, like looking around, it's because it's downstairs and I hadn't quite moved it up. Like there's like three or four of these downstairs that I did not carry up because they were super heavy. Like the John Cena drawer, haven't gotten that up here a lot of other stuff that we hadn't gotten up here but that's gonna wrap up the video for today man thank you guys so very much for watching again kind of just a basic walkthrough but i hope you guys did kind of enjoy you know see some of the behind the scenes a little bit what i'm dealing with here but that is gonna wrap up today's video man huge shout out to our patreon members of the mdt youtube channel always appreciate those guys and this month actually the giveaway prize for the patreon is going to be an ultimate edition cody Rhodes. so we'll be giving one of these away in the shipper and everything to somebody over on the patreon so a huge shout out to those guys always appreciate their support this month we are giving away an ultimate edition cody Rhodes, man so extreme division members and higher do get entered automatically every month so look forward to that but that's gonna wrap up the video man thank you guys so very much hope you guys did enjoy leave me your thoughts down below if you guys have any ideas for the office i'm getting out of here subscribe to the channel follow me on instagram twitter and tiktok on my damn toys i'll see you guys next time have a blessed one and i'll catch you later